the Electronics Recycling Depot here in Fairbanks, Alaska. Electronics Recycling happens once a month for a couple days. So welcome to our broadcast. This is Snowflake Down. We're here at the Green Star Electronics Recycling Depot. And we're going to go in and see how recycling is done in Alaska. There's some cool action We're in going there. to talk to a couple people and, and check it out. So here we go. Alright, so we have lots of electronics being recycled. We're going to go... Alright, so could you tell us a little bit about what's going on here? Uh, well, this is our monthly collection for electronics recycling. It happens free uh, to the borough every month. People are dropping off all their electronics, anything that has a quarter fixed batteries. And we're Great. getting it recycled, it's free to drop off, doesn't cost anything to the borough. And then you guys sort it out, it looks like. Huh? Yeah, we're sorting our, our recycler, we're sorting the computers, the glass screen TVs and monitors, batteries, uh, and any other miscellaneous electronics, hair dryers, alarm clocks, such like that. Yeah. Uh, well, all right, yeah, cool. Kitchen appliances, you guys don't take anything. Anything that has a quarter fixed batteries. That's awesome. I'm curious, like, how, how much do you guys get recycled, like how much recycled yeah. per ton or... Right, so we've recycled over a million pounds of electronics since we started in 2006, so that's about 557 tons. Oh my gosh. Um, our goal uh, this year is 165 tons. So last year we recycled 134.8 tons. Yeah. I know. Where does it go? So it goes down to Tilbury Plant, which is an east steward. Why that's important is they make sure that their workers are safe and protected and they never ship the electronics to third world countries. So okay. um, it's a third party auditing to make sure that everything is environmentally safe. And yeah. Well, I was wondering about that. Mm -hmm. I know there's a lot of electronics recycling. Yeah. Yeah. So none of that. Nope. Well, I know you're busy. There's a lot going on. Yeah. Is there anything you want to add about electronics recycling it seems pretty fun like yeah, there's a lot going on and it you know it's important to keep it out of the landfill because there is lead um, mercury cadmium all these heavy metals right and so eventually it could leach out into the groundwater and get into the wells that's no good no and then also <laughs> did you know that there is over 600 times more gold in a ton of cell phones than in a ton of earth. So oh, huh. you can you can dig up you can dig up a ton of earth and you'll get some gold out. But if you compile a ton of cell phones, you'll get 600 times the amount of gold. So it's really silly to throw it away. So <laughs> so another aspect is that we um, basically reclaim the precious metals instead yeah. of throwing it away. That's sweet. It's like gold mining and electronics. Exactly. And it's shipped away, right? And the yeah, borough yeah. helps subsidize that? Is that right? So the borough helps subsidize the cost of the recycling, and Airland Transport is a transportation company that donates a trailer every month, and we ship it down to, to Anchorage. And eventually it goes to Seattle. That's where Total Reclaim's plant is. And if you can imagine a gigantic coffee grinder, it's sort of that concept. So <laughs> The electronics go in and then it gets all ground up and then the glass goes one way and plastic another and the metal another and eventually it's sold on the commodities market. So. All right, cool. great. That was some great information. All right, thanks everyone for checking out our video. Alaska Trash this week was uh, the recycling that goes on here. So thanks again. Check out our YouTube channel, Snowflake Down, and we'll see you next time. Yeah, thanks you guys. Fairbanks!